Why are you crying for? Hmm? Why are you crying? Hmm? Looking nice today. Yes, you are looking nice. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm taking you with me to London. You know, central London with a baby, you know, on the train, on the bus. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of a challenge. We went with my husband the other day, um, you know, and her with her buggy and all that. It was... It's not the easiest thing, but you can manage. Um, especially if you go by train, some tube stations, they don't have lifts. So you have to carry the buggy on the stairs, which is ridiculous. I don't know why in 2021, they don't have lifts in every flipping tube station. I feel for the disabled people and all that. Anyway, as I was saying, eh, today I'm going... I have to go to Central London to sort out my passport and all that because I'm traveling to Cyprus soon. I might go to Oxford Street after because I actually miss going to Oxford Street. I used to not like it, but now it's been so long and now restrictions are lifted and all that. So I would like to go in around and have a look and and see how the world operates because, you know, I'm always in the house doing online shopping and all that and i don't know what's going on if you're new here my name is athena and i'm making videos related to motherhood fashion and uh, fashion related to curvy bodies and all that before i um before i go i just want to show you what i'm gonna pack today so yeah here is just the um i have some nappies some muslin cloth and some and have and a beep some baby wipes very essential a, a an outfit like a leggings and a top if she you know if she gets messy or now she starts eating so um, I'm gonna take with me these multi sweet corn rings just as a snack and um yeah and obviously milk so i'm gonna show you how i pack my milk you want to play yes you want to you like it you like it where are you where are you oh there you go no i can see a smile now so i've got my thermos and i prepare water I don't want to see your fingers um, so I prepare um, water that is gonna be sufficient for two bottles of milk so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take two bottles of milk <laughs> Irish so I'm gonna take two bottles of milk and prepare um, and put some you know some milk powder in it. I'm gonna prepare for about 180 millimeters. That's about five scoops. Yeah, that's Iris blocking my view. I don't hold her. She's gonna start crying because she's tired and she doesn't want to sleep. But once I put her in the buggy, she will sleep. You guys, you will see. So yeah, I prepared two bottles of milk. That's just the powder. So when I'm ready to feed her, I will just put some water in it. So that's my bottles, my water, the water on the side. And I just want to show you this. That's for, uh, you know, purees or creams. So it's very good uh, to have it with you when you're on the go. A friend gave it to me and it's very lovely even at home i i give it straight from here so you just put the cream or whatever puree that you want and then you just open that when you're ready to feed her and then you just feed her okay 
let's not forget my earphones because my favorite thing to do when I'm in the train or the bus is have my music on so I think we are ready that's our outfit for the day chunky white gold trainers high-waisted mom jeans and some hoodie with some design well puffy gillet i would say and my beautiful bag and some sunglasses and irish i saw i showed you her outfit just added some cardigan and her hat and her trainers and we are i think we are ready to go are we ready to go are we ready to go are we are you excited yes yes you are so yeah so the weather is it's supposed to be summer but it's a bit windy it's a bit cold not really cold but it's 20 20 degrees that's why i'm wearing this uh, if it gets too hot i would take the <coughs> gillette and just stay with the hoodie yes we are ready don't pull my hair please I think the weather is quite warm so this is enough because I feel a bit hot I put the gillette under the baggie as you can see and I took out the sweater as well I think it's just <laughs> yes you are so excited yes so yeah I think we are ready to go What did I tell you? Wait for the bus. back so basically it's a hot day so I'm kind of regretting for what wearing this but yeah it was alright um, we went to we hung out a little bit we walked uh, Regis Street then Oxford Street um, I wanted to go to Mango but they moved the shop I don't know where also forever to a forever 21 Got shut down as well a lot of shop a lot of oh god I can't even talk a lot of shops have um, been moved or shut down or I don't know so yeah so everything went well you know apart from you know when I go to the CPO embassy I don't know why they don't have a lift or 
whether there was you know a horse staircase but one guy there were a lot of people that were you know you could just come across and um and they will help you you know when this is used with the baby people are really prone you know to help you and yeah one guy helped me with that then another lady when i went but i was in bond street, bond street and i had to take the lift but there was like four stairs before the lift so one lady helped me and yeah in the buses was a bit you know um sometimes getting off and on is a bit tricky but apart from that it was a good day you know we just hung out we did i didn't buy anything i just you know i just went around the shelves i, I couldn't be bothered really i didn't see anything interesting you know i was a bit annoyed uh that i couldn't get to go to mango and also at zara i was annoyed there was a lift you know on the woman's floor and then there was more stairs that you could first floor whatever there was stairs that you can see more clothes and there was kind of a, a, a lift um it was like it's like a platform where for wheelchairs and all that and it wasn't working so i'm thinking to myself again disabled people how do would they manage to you know so i couldn't be, i was annoyed because there were no people around as well like um you know people that from that work at the shop they were not where to be found you know to ask is the lift broken or how you know so i was so annoyed and i left even even people there like i feel like when people buy they are becoming so selfish they're just so eager to grab clothes to see stuff but they don't even care about the other people you know around them so everyone just walk past you and i was like i was so annoyed you know and um yeah i just i just left and knowing that zara and all these big brands aged them i've seen a documentary on how they exploit the workers to make very very cheap clothes like jeans for like 50p and then they will sell it for 30 40 pounds which is ridiculous and they pay the work workers like peanuts so having all that in mind i didn't even go to age them they are the worst when it comes to that talking about that i've got a i'm working on something at the moment uh it's just something that i always wanted to do and um i took the decision to work towards it i don't know how it's gonna come out i don't know if i'm gonna make it but yeah i'm trying to w use my free time till i get to work to build something and then get it out there for i'm i don't want to say anything yet because i don't want to jinx it i'm just praying that it's gonna work out because i really want to um to get to a point where i'm gonna be you know having my own business with my husband and all that we, we me and my husband we all we're trying to uh build our own business and not to work for anyone at the end of the day you know i think it's the most satisfying to have a project and and to work on to work on something that is yours and get it out there people see it and appreciate it i think that's the best feeling and i love being creative so when i discover something i really like i really like i really love working on it so this is what i'm at now i found it's not that i found it now i've been all it's been always on my mind since i was i was a kid as well i wanted to do that so now i'm just trying to walk towards it and fingers crossed good luck that's that was the video for today thank you guys for coming with me thank you for watching this video don't forget to support my channel like this video share it subscribe and do all that it really helps me and i really appreciate it and um hopefully i'll see you very very soon bye for now bye bye i need to get her change she was a very good girl as well she she will sleep for most parts 
and she had had two bottles of milk she didn't need anything else and um yeah she's been a very very good girl yes she by now she by why 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 all night long yeah we dance with our raisin tongues and all day long